Hi you guys, my name is Luigi Davila and this is going to be my first ever YouTube video. So I hope you guys do enjoy this. I'm sorry if the video quality isn't amazing. Um, I am doing this video on my iPhone, so yeah. I'll get a better camera in the future. So a little bit about myself. My name is Luigi. I'm 20 years old. I'm from Puerto Rico. I go to college in um, New York and I really do like these videos about fashion blogging and doing reviews on like designer merchandise and stuff like that and yeah I hope you guys do enjoy this I'm gonna do a really quick review slash unboxing even though I've already used this piece for about two and a half almost three weeks and yeah so let's get started so I'm gonna be doing a review of a Saint Laurent piece this is the shopping bag that it came with. It's made of like this legal document paper material. It opens up like this. And inside you have this little envelope and this is where they give you the receipt and everything. Um, let me just show it real quick. This is the same material. This, the box, is all the same material and like the authenticity card and everything. It's all the same material as the shopping bag, so it's really good. I guess they're like recycling or something. Um, so this is the receipt. I hope you guys can see it. Saint Laurent. Yeah, this is the receipt. Um, so let's get started on the piece. So the wallet, small leather good, as they say in the website, um, comes in this box. It's a really small box. The smell of the leather is like really hard. So you can smell it like even from inside the box in the dust bag. Comes with these stickers. I don't know what they are. They're probably codes from the store or something. Um, the wallet does come in this really small dust bag. It says Saint Laurent. It's a really good dust bag though, like it's so, so soft, and then the inside of it, I already showed the whole item there, um, the inside of it is this canvas lining, so it's really, really good, and even inside of the dust bag, there's this Saint Laurent Paris made in Italy tag, so it's a really good material and everything. Um, besides that, there's this little pouch here, which I was surprised that they didn't put these cards like inside of the wallet or anything but again it comes in an envelope style here's ooh, here's the authenticity card that it comes with it i don't know if you guys let me zoom in whatever um there's this little envelope that tells you how they do the leathers and blah, blah, blah. Then they have this card, which is where the description of the wallet is, which I don't know how to say it or anything because it's all written in French and I did take like a year's worth of French in college, but <laughs> that didn't work out. And then they have this card, which is the control card, I think. So, wow. Amazing. Um, let me just put this all inside here. So yeah, everything comes in here. I guess it's really comfortable. Do I want to like ever resell this bag or anything? I have everything already inside of this pouch and it's taped, so it's not gonna get lost. Because I know that um, Louis Vuitton always. That's like a big mess that Louis Vuitton does. Like all of their little cards are all thrown over the wallet and the bag and it's like oh oh okay i didn't even know i had this so um so this is the wallet i have like a little scuff there this is the wallet it is a ysl card holder in this sort of caviar leather chanel chevron style I really do like the chevron on this wallet. It's really nice. I like it better than the Chanel. And it comes with the gold YSL emblem. Let me just show you real quick. This perfect. It has five slots, as you guys can see. One, two, 
three, four, and then the fifth one right here. And then inside of it has the Saint Laurent Paris made in Italy right there. And then on the other side has the, ooh, the number, which I don't think you guys can see. But they're there. It's like a really long hold. But yeah, so this is the wallet. I really like it. Um, it did come in like 13 other colors and leathers and lambskin and like goat skin, whatever. Um, it does come in like purple, brown, green. Um, has It comes croc and bows, with, which was another option that I really wanted to get. Um, and the YSL was like in silver. It did come in matte. And the letters here was black matte and then the leather was less shinier than this one um it also did come in the regular saint laurent the newer saint laurent style which is only has saint laurent paris but those i really did feel the leather and i didn't like it it was kind of like sturdy and it reminded me of like the antigona by givenchy leather which i'm not that big of a fan of um because it just anything scratches it and it's over this one i do have to say i have my love-hate relationship with it it gets scuffed extremely easily it's not for the money that i spent i could have gotten a louis, two louis vuitton card holders and they would have hold like held up their value more um i did want to get a chanel card holder but um i do have some other chanel pieces that i want to get that are um more usable and like day-to-day -day use instead of this which is um when i have to go out and get something real quick and then come back in or whatever um i do have to say it does tear extremely easily i've been using it for two and a half weeks and i'm i'm not that gentle with my designer pieces i'm more of a oh like i'm gonna use it like if i get it if i spend the money i'm not gonna be like oh, i'm gonna like save it for a rainy day which doesn't make sense because then why are you gonna spend the money um but yeah this is wearing tearing really easily i'm going to show you a quick example i don't know if you guys can see it right there in that corner it's already like breaking a little bit and let me show you um like the metro card you put it inside here and it's already after two weeks of using it stretched out and then it comes out really really easily i'll show you with one of my um, credit cards to put it in boom it's really really stretched out already it is comfortable if it's a lot of credit cards in it i've been able to put four credit cards in this and it still has more space and it still stretches so it is good but at the same time mm, um i would recommend this to people it is really valuable if you don't if you do want to like test the waters with Saint Laurent, I would rather say get the other one, the original one, the one that has the sort of their like Antigona leather, but it does have it. Cause how do I say this? With Saint Laurent, I'm not really a big fan of like the these types of bags, the chain bags. I'm more of a fan of the Zac du Jour bag, and I really want to get that one in the near future. Um, I've been saving up a lot, and I really do want to get it in sort of the croc and boast leather which i did feel with the card holder and it is amazing as it is extremely soft it's not really like obviously crocodile but um it smells more of like this type of leather and yeah this leather also it's really um it shines a lot and by itself is heavy for no reason um, these over here are really squishy. You guys can see it. So those are the whole details of it. This is the back of the wallet. This is the front of the wallet. And that's it. So, as I said, this is my first ever YouTube video. Um, I really did hope you guys enjoy it. Um, I love this video. In no way, shape, or form was I bragging. Or showing off or anything I just really 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 like these videos I spend a lot of time watching them and like doing my research on designer pieces except Saint Laurent because I just started with it um, so yeah um, I'm gonna be doing more reviews on designer items that I have from Balenciaga, Louis Vuitton, Fendi, um, Givenchy so 
I really do hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please subscribe to it, um, like it, follow me on Instagram, which I'll put a link up here if I can. And yeah, thank you guys so much, and I'll put another video up soon. So, bye!